Welcome everybody, it's Turbo Terramino here, and today's a great day because we are back playing some Animal Crossing New Horizons. Let me fix my filter, it was perfectly fine up until I started the stream. That's how it goes, right? Because I'm streaming during the day, it the uh, green screen tends to uh, be different every day, dependent on the light coming through my office window. So that's good. All right. Hope everyone's doing well today. Let's go ahead and get into some Animal Crossing. Looks like we have a uh, Sable hanging out. She gonna be in the shot? Yes, she is. Look at that. Getting all gussied up. Hello, everyone. This is Tom Nook. It's 11.09 a.m. this happy Tuesday, March 24th, 2020. Now for today's news. Melee Island gained a new neighbor today. Rattle. Rattle. If you happen to see him, please give him a warm welcome. All right, it's time for our final announcement for today. For all you, all of you DIY loving island residents out there, I have a very special announcement. DIY veterans can now take part in a special customization workshop I'm hosting. Sweet! Learning how to customize will help you change up the project, uh, change up the look of any DIY projects you create. I have no doubt it will broaden your creative expertise. I will conduct this DIY uh, workshop inside Resident Services. Continues crafting. Uh, enjoy the day. So there's a bunch of stuff that I did overnight um, after yesterday's midday stream. Um, first, I placed the plots of three homes, and I did that in the stream. Um, yesterday, I ended up... Hey, Nam. Yesterday, I ended up um, housing a bunch of... Um, furniture in those homes. My phone's ringing. Hello, this is Timmy from Nook's Cranny. I've reached Turbo, right? We've sent a payment to your bank of 41,892 bells, which you left in the Dropbox. Thank you for using the service. Hope to see the shop soon. I also put a bunch of stuff in the Dropbox last night. Um, so as you can see, nothing much is different of my home, but I do have a fence. Um, so I created a little fence here. I cleaned this area up a little bit. My sleeping bag's down there if I want to sleep and, and watch the stars. And I still have my work area. I have a bamboo doll DIY for anyone who needs it. Um, the, in the inside of my house isn't, isn't much different from the last we showed. Got a little train set. Some foosball. I got two boots that I fished up, so I reconstructed them. Now we have a new resident they said Rattle. I don't I don't recall who Rattle is. Alright, so we got a lot of stuff here. So from Dodo Airlines. Let us like to thank you for flying Dodo Airlines. We know you don't have a lot of options, but thanks for choosing us all the same. We hope you enjoy this bit of custom Dow merch. Nifty, right? Sweet. Um, we got the MVP, T, Denim Pants. To the Edge, which is some music, Sporty Shades, Nook Mileage Program. We wish to express our gratitude for your continued use in the Nook Shop, Nook Mileage Program. I had to be claimed via our redemption service. Okay, so that might be the, um, the, what is it called? The, uh, carpet. I just got the last iron nuggets for the shop. That, w that was a hard thing to collect. It definitely was. Okay. Let's move this. Perfect. 
Um, where do we get this from? Dodo Airlines. Hold on. Yup. Wearing that. MVP tee. Just so I have it. Dead and pants. We're gonna wear these. Next, I need new shoes. To the edge with Vegas music. Sporty shades. We're gonna put these on. So I look like a big douche. And we're gonna we're gonna shuffle, increase the volume in my uh, talking skull, my little Murray there. Yeah, the iron nuggets were tough to get. They definitely were. All right. So yeah, so what I did last night, um, I completed the interior and exterior um, requirements for the three homes. 10,000 bells. Oh, I'm broke. Oh, look at that little tea set. What is this, like a demon? What is this? Throwback gothic mirror? That's scary. I'll buy it anyway. I mean, not now because I don't have the money, but there's a popcorn machine? Definitely buying that. Who doesn't like popcorn? Uh, let's see. Any new DIYs? Beginners, test, slingshot, ladder, vaulting pole. Okay. Nothing crazy. You gotta pick up some cash. I ended up spending all my money, and then because everything was closed, I couldn't get anything. Ooh, here's a money spot. One thousand bells. Back in the hole. All right, let's go. Go to the bank and pull out some money. I have yet to pay off any uh, any cash to my uh, home enlargement. Oh, here we go. Ah, uh, Turbo. Hello, hello. As you might have heard, today's broadcast we're not offering a new uh, new workshop on customization. I think you'll find the DIY even more fun when you master the skill. I do hope that you take me up on this opportunity. Sure. Let me get cash out first. 200 bonus. Gimme. There we go. We have 120 in the bank. We'll do our, our, do our best to pay everything off. I already bought... Oh, I didn't buy these. So buy these. I got I got Nook Miles out my my took us. Just buy him. Somehow I've logged in six days. Oh boy, you time jumping? Let's see what else we have. I don't think anything else is new. No. Actually, you know what? Let's buy. Mm, we'll get it later. Oh, I want to. I want to check out the Nook shopping. A camping cot, Miss Flamingo, outdoor hat, oval glasses, Konnichiwa. Yes. Outdoor shorts. Sure. Rubber toed shoes. KK Western, which I already have. Okay. I figure I can recolor those shoes. 
Hi. Oh, I have to do the workshop thing. No, you haven't. Hmm. All right. And then also what I did as well was I literally pulled because I wasn't pulling any weeds from like the second story or the third story of the island, the levels. So last night I ended up pulling all the weeds. I dug out all the flowers except for this first general like area. Um, and I'll show you real quick before I talk to Sable since I'm on the subject. There's like this little area over here that doesn't have much. I mean, I could eventually put houses here because there is enough space. But I ended up like putting like all my flowers here. And that way it's just much easier to uh, water. Remember, that's how you plant and uh, replant the flowers. I made the mistake before of uh, of just pulling the buds out. So I don't know yet if I like eventually want to put people's houses here or if I just want to make this like a flower, a designated flower area. And I don't know if I am going to like mix them so they can create hybrids, I don't know yet. I just kind of like wanted to get them all kind of centralized at least like off like right away. I put a little fencing there so people can't like come up on them on the back area. I may like quarantine them off. I don't know yet. But yeah. So that took me a bit because I literally took the flowers and the weeds from all around my island and put them all there with the obvious exception of like what I showed you before um, next to like Nook's place and stuff I've got some at my house see what you got good morning turbo it's afternoon but that's fine thanks for stopping by how could I help you today just want to say hi what's on sale you got ears what I'm selling today um I think I'm gonna buy all these and then like sell them <laughs> so I give her business buy the same thing twice. I hear a package. I heard it. What 
I get what I get. Oh, learn these. I loved how um, when I got the uh, the itemized ad advancement on my backpack or whatever you want to call it. Punching bag. I know who I'm going to send that to. Um, I like how he's like, oh, I can reorganize things this way and then open up more inventory. I really like that. That's what we call for role-playing purposes in D&D. My character's really good at medicine, but uh, I'm going to role-play it to make sure that everyone understands, like, that's why I'm good at medicine. Which, uh, which level are you uh, paying off? Is it the first one, the second one, third one? Just an insult house? Or is it the expansion? Is it the any extra rooms? You know what? I might just send these to like villagers as gifts. I hear someone. <gasps> Harvey's here! What are you doing here, Harvey? You just first level. Did you expand your house yet? Or is it just like the initial house payment? I think I want to switch my shades to these ones. Yo, Harvey just strolling up. Dude, just chill. He's like, hey, I'm here. Take your time, man. Take your time, man. I'll be here whenever you're done. Small house, okay. So you're paying off your initial house build. I don't know if he's going to sell stuff. I don't know what's going on with him. Take your time, bro. I'll be here, man. Don't even worry about it, bro. Let me switch these glasses. I thought I liked these better. Maybe it's just because I don't like feet. I don't like it with my outfit. Harvey, where'd you go? There you are. Hey, yeah, hey. You live on this island, man? Thought so. From, like, the next island over? My name's Harvey. Glad to meet you, friend. You can call me Harv if you want. Wonder why no one ever does that. It's the they part. Just fun to say. Sorry. Got a bit sidetracked there. I came here for a reason. Give me a minute. And I'll remember why. Got it. I keep hearing about this island and how much folks dig the scene here, man. I thought I'd check it out. I'm going to start this far out artist collective, dude. I'm looking for ideas. So what's the deal? I heard that this place was deserted, like literally a deserted island, man. You the honcho that put this place on the head of the class? Wait, this good old noodle had a casserole of an idea, bro. You should visit my island. Just hit the airport and tell him you want to go to Harv's Island. That's the name of my pad. Groovy, right? Anyway, nice job with you. I'm going to stroll around and see what makes Melee Island tick. Yo, so we go to his island? What? Guys, that's cool. That's really cool. Oh, and then I also um, wished upon a bunch of stars again. Like a bunch of them. I'm going to run out of space, but that's okay. Oh. You got a second? I want to bug you about something. Do you have to introduce yourself to Rattle yet? Maybe this is weird, but he's around me and it's feeling like a whole new place. It's got me wondering, how do we make this place more welcoming for when someone like Rattle comes along? I think maybe it's time to give Melee Island a little more personality. Don't get me wrong, I'm all about the vibe of what's going on now. I just want to amp it up some. You get, and uh, that going brought us something kind of rad. Do you think you could find a spot for it? Sure, what is it? It's a utility pole. Okay don't know if I'll do a utility pole, but uh, thank you so much, Sylvia, for your generosity. So 
this is uh, Sylvia on the left. Rudy on the right. So how many, like, fossils is it a day? Oh, get out of your weeds. Oh, of course. Just drop it. All right, so let me... Let me send some of these letters out real quick. So I can give people some stuff. Again, this is what happened last night. I had like 600 bells. I went to go send out some letters. Oh, that's Rattle. Yeah, he was the first guy. The first. The first guy. He's the sick boy. Um. There we go. Welcome. I should probably say to Melee Island. Be sure to cough or sneeze into your shoulder. There's a reason my villager wears a doctor's mask. <laughs> um, wait. There's a reason why, um... Yeah, they don't do anything. At least from what the CDC says. Um, there's a reason why, um... Rattle is wearing a mask. And that's because he is... By the uh, printing of his um, sk skin, um, he's a poisonous frog. Okay. But yeah, they say that the masks don't do anything. They do something if you're the one sick. Um, we're going to give him some house slippers. Can you give him more than one? No. Okay. And then we're going to send this to... Rudy. Uh... Get on it, bro. I'm going to send him the punching bag. I'm interested for tonight. Spider's new character gets revealed. Oh, boy. So, uh, Nam, you guys do... Do you guys do Roll20? How do you guys do it? Or do you do it, like, manually, but just do it online? For everyone else, D&D. &D, for anyone else who doesn't know what I'm asking. 
Can't forget Sylvia. Roll 20 and Discord. Okay. We were able, uh, we did roll 20 for the first time Sunday. And, um, it was, it was pretty fun. I still like doing it in person. But it's a, it's a good alternative. And you could take your utility pole back. Okay. You got Nook Miles for doing something. Pen Pal. Art school boy or girl. I haven't messed with the, uh, the nicknames at all. Let's see what we have. Autonomous Papa. Aggressive Papa. Let's do... Autonomous... Autonomous Intellectual. For now. I actually kind of like that fencing. This fence. The corral fence. Right now I have the country fence. No, I don't. I have the, uh... I don't, the one I can't craft. The picket fence. Man, I'm excited I can go to... Harvey's place. We're going to sell a few things. Check for fossils. Continue to scour the beaches. So you can pick up more star pieces and in, in, uh, in shells. And then we'll go to Harvey's Island. We need to see what the hot item is, too. A wooden bucket. I have a ton of these I need to take out. That was my old fence, but I can use these to build like um, log bridges. So I figured I'll keep them for now. And then if I have the ability to uh, build more. Look, she's sleeping next to Winnie the Pooh. He was sitting up in the corner. She must have straightened him out and then laid him next to her. 
Uh, let's get our rocks. Ugh, so many stones. You can dig rocks. Yeah, so you can hit them with your shovel. But be warned, if, um... You have eaten any fruit, and you've got a fruit counter in the upper left-hand corner of your screen. Do not hit the rock with the shovel, because it will break. I do not know yet if they come back. Or, like, show up in a different position, so just be very careful with that. But yes, you can hit um, rocks, those types of rocks, with a shovel. And you'll end up getting stones, you'll get the iron... And you can get clay. I have a stone axe anyway. Um, yeah, you can use a shovel or you can use an axe. Let's see what this is. A uh, message in a bottle. Found this DIY why recipe. I still can't ever say that correctly super fast. I don't remember writing it down. Entrusted my recipe to the sea in the hopes that someone makes it. It's simple. Okay, we just have the parts. A wooden toolbox. I want to see what this looks like. Oh, cute. Zero pocket, zero storage. So it's just for show. Okay. Got like 63. Oh, uh, for the money rock? Yep. You can get more than that, too. As long as you dig holes behind you and you don't have to, uh, you don't have to worry about being bounced back. You'll see, I find, I'll find one eventually. So I saw a wisp last night, and I was trying to catch his little wispies after I scared him. And I was walking through here, and like his little ghost things were coming. I was like, oh my gosh, this is like a haunted forest. Because there's so many trees in this area. So who's this? Rattle? Let's go say hi. Nice and chic house. Tom Nook stepping up. Aw, oh, you're still in boxes. Hey, Turbo. Man, I took your advice to move here as quick as I could. This is a real nice island. I bet my bug friends are going to like it. And then in here, and I bet I'll meet more bug friends here. Okay. I don't, I don't like how you have a dirt floor, but whatever. I love with spirits. We're located in one section. No, but, um... But there was one that went through and then I couldn't find one for a very long time. And then I eventually found it. It was in that area. So I think it kind of like floated over. Star piece? Yes. Star fragment. Uh, I was wishing on stars last night. I didn't get a lot of them. But I wished on a few of them. You know one thing I haven't noticed? I haven't seen any pitfalls. How? Um, so basically, you'll hear a little, like, shimmer in the sky. And without equipment, you look up at the sky, and you, then you click the A button. At the right time as the star is shooting across the sky. And then you'll kind of, like, make a face, and it'll light up. And then that'll tell you that you successfully wished on that star. 
Uh, let's go from behind here because I don't want to mess that tree up. Here we go. There we go. 8,000. <clears throat> nice. We got some cash. I'll tell you what, the ability to, um, re- like, like, pick up trees and, like, move them somewhere else is so convenient. It's really convenient. I enjoy it. So I got some bamboo growing. Just looking for rocks right now. area to check. I can't tell if I hear a package or not. Yeah, I do. Also, you get Nook Miles if you drop a package in the water. Yo, 10,000 bells! Thank you. Thank you, Sky Gods. Unfortunately, I put this, this Tiki Torch there so I can't get that back flower. Oh well. Oh, that house is sold. I just noticed that. That one too. Oh boy. The god of chance must like you. Seriously. There's a rock over here. Hey, JR. She's singing. Oh, I wanted to... I wanted to do this, this song with her. Good playing AC2. You having fun with the game, dude? Oh, she's playing the song that goes, Yount me, yount me, yount me. I was trying to play with her. Can you 
play well enough, maybe you can summon <laughs> summon good old KK. That's the first time I've heard anyone singing in the game. Maybe if you play well enough, Nick will make money of it. I'm sure he will. Look, I got my second gold nugget. So, J uh, JR, how long have you played Animal Crossing? Are you new to the series? Did you just start on this game? Or uh, how long have you been playing the, uh, the series? I have a huge open space over here. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Nook always makes monies. I have New Leaf and never really played it. Ah. New Leaf was good. I personally got really bored of it just because I streamed so much of it. But, uh, I've been playing Animal Crossing since the original, since the GameCube. <clears throat> and there goes my shovel. I think I got a bunch of these irons. And that's all of my rocks, I think. I don't think I have any more. Oh, there's one right there. That's a new rock. So I guess the rocks do uh, pop back up. It's actually, we don't have to go all the way to the house. I was late to the party, so I had no one to play with. Aw. Yeah, I was streaming for a while, and then uh, a good amount of time for New Leaf. And then I just got so burnt out on it, so I stopped. So I'm super happy that uh, this is here, so I can play Animal Crossing again and not be completely bored with the game. Uh, we need to shovel. We need five hardwood. All right, so we're going to have to go back to the house. Let's do the workshop while we're here for the customization. Ready to dip your toes in the delightful waters of customization? Yes! Taking visitors? Not right now. We're going to focus on particular streams where we'll be doing um, viewers' islands. Um, but not right now. Just because I'm not doing it at a... Normally, I like to do that when we're a little bit further into the game after we've established more tutorial stuff. And we want to expand a little bit off what's going on. And then if I'm doing it at night... Um, there's less to do in the game during, um, at nighttime. So, like, that'll be a good time to visit everyone's islands. I caught a whale shark at a friend's island, but connection is lost and I lost him. Boo! That sucks. But, uh, we do do that stuff, JR. Honestly, it's incredibly simple. First, you need the item you want to customize along with the required number of customization kits, and then you customize your item on the workbench. The design color will change in the blink of an eye. I do believe you'll find it easier to understand once you try it yourself, so let's get started. The goal for this is to make a wooden wardrobe and to do some customization. Let's craft. Oh, fart. You're going to make me go all the way home. I'm taking this dreamy sweater out of the trash. Somebody, last night, they put a, um, a miniature money tree in the recycling. Which was really weird. So I planted it here, so we'll see what happens. Uh, I need wood. What I need? Hardwood and regular wood.
But did you... What deal did you make with... Orange Genesis? I'm sorry. For RNG... RNGesus. Excuse me. Nothing. I'm just a good boy. I've got two gold nuggets. I don't know what we're going to do with them yet. I'm just a good boy, so RNGesus just rewards me. Uh, that's probably not enough wood. I have to make another shovel, too, before I forget. Rolled very well on a D100. So, Nom, that's funny. So we we killed a Cyclops and um, Sunday night, and we're supposed to roll something on the uh, our DM does the the treasure table. So when my friend was inspecting the body, what well, was actually it was on a it was on a a dwarf that got crushed we're thinking by a dinosaur and um he inspected it, he got a natural 20 on it so she rolled a d100 for the treasury table and uh so we already have a wand of secrets that i found but i gave it to another player because it doesn't make sense for my character to um, use a wand of secrets. But, um, so she was like, alright, we lost our bag of holding when we, when half our party got killed by the pirates and they took it, we couldn't find it. So she was like, alright, she, she was like, you can have another wand of secrets or I can give you a bag of holding. So we're like, bag of holding! And not only that, um, he is a goblin artificer and he has the ability to duplicate items. Only like up to like six or something like that. So he's gonna basically have a. <laughs> he's gonna have the. Um, where did it go? Here. Okay. He's basically gonna have the bag of holding to himself, and then he's gonna duplicate it, and then we're gonna have one to share. Which my character would probably. Probably carry it. Oh, that just reminded me since you said the 100. Alright, put this storage, storage. She was like, yeah, because you rolled a, a natural 20 and I rolled a 100 on the table. She was like, I'll be willing to give you one. All right, so I guess we have to go back to Nook. Maybe if I had a roll. A D1000 for getting answers from a god. Oh, geez. He rolled a 28. Aren't you supposed to roll low or something like that for those? Uh, about that workshop. I got the wooden wardrobe. I think it means it's time for you to customize it. I'll give you the customization kits you need for the moment. So please step to the workbench. Some customization kits. Ooh. Put your wooden wardrobe and try customizing it. How did you get so much furniture? Um... A lot of it I'll, I built, but I'll go back and I'll show you. 
You can add fabric to some of these things. Okay. And this is the, the bridge. Um, so the fencing you get through story. You can build these. You can build this. All this wooden stuff you can build. This, this. I bought this on the first day along with... I built that. Build this, build this. I got the sleeping bag from someone. My wife gave me this. You can build that. Uh, let me check online. So the barrel... Both of these barrels and the skull. The skull was bought. The barrels were... The barrel was built, I think, by a friend of mine when I would visit her island. The barrel was bought. This came out of a tree on an island. Um, this was given to me, this foosball table. This rug was bought in the nook shop. Do you remember how I got this chair? But the table was built. The microwave, the tea set, and the food was given to me by friends. This was found. Built the bookshelves. The mirror I built. This I bought. This came with the house. Friend got me this. I bought the toilet. I got the vacuum somehow. Got the skull with red eyes. And then, um, most of this is bought, given, found, Yeah. I was trying to remember because I saw Wisp last night and he decided to give me common wallpaper, but I don't have it anywhere. Let's turn in these fossils. Excuse me, my nose is runny. That's what happens when I don't blow my nose before I stream. Assess these fossils, young lad. Ooh, hoo, hooray! I found something that is not part of our Steam collection. It is magnificent indeed. You have tens for finding young fossils. Don't worry, bladders, you can have them. Wait. Jolly good, yes. Oh, one of them they already have. What is this? Ammonite. I'm oh, glad they take these off your hands. Okay. Ooh, got some nook miles. Oh, I didn't see this. So this is 150 or 300. Let's see. Okay, so it's a times two. So it gave me 300. Take a photo. Why not? There. Give me those nook miles. What do they want? Sell shells, plant trees. Don't they have a bunch of shells? They do. B. 
Yeah, man. I, I love the, uh, the ability to um, just kind of like zone out and just do like menial tasks. Like what uh, of my uh, mods pinged me last night and she was like, oh, are you streaming tonight? I was like, nah, I just want to play in the dark in bed. And I spent so many hours just like pulling weeds, relocating flowers and stuff like that. Okay, I want the popcorn machine. Ew, dude, it's too expensive. I'm gonna buy it anyway, though. What's this? Low screen. Nah. Nah. You should stream that too. I know. <laughs> I know. So that was, I was thinking about that last time. I was like, this is the stuff that people actually do like to watch. <laughs> people do at Animal Crossing. Just pull weeds and relocate flowers for like three hours. Oh, I didn't hit this rock. I'm a hit it. Oh, and there's the other rock in front of the town hall I haven't done either. Yep. Okay, not bad. So, uh, JR, do you, what's, what's your opinion on time hopping? Do you do it yourself or, uh, how do you feel about it? Did you get the refrigerator? No. I did, I did it once, there's no multiplayer on day one. Ah. No shade being thrown. Oh, large star piece. I don't do it, but I definitely know um, it's certainly tempting. But like the what I've always said in past streams for Animal Crossing, like, like you just play the way you want to play. I think we scoured this side of the beach, actually. I think it's stupid not to have multiplayer on day one. I just think that they were trying to make sure that we weren't, the, the general player, whether we are familiar with Animal Crossing or not, be not to be overwhelmed with what was going on. Because um, my wife is like, oh, I, I can't get to like, I can't get to like the back of the island. And I'm like, well, they're probably doing it so you have like a more of a centralized area to work in. Or else you might get too lost or... Okay, yeah, we scoured the beach. But I will say for myself, I didn't time jump, but I did end up going to a friend's island where I bought the, um, the ladder recipe a day early. So, I mean, you only have to do it, but I want the option to do it. Yeah, and I and I think it presents itself as as what what? Gingham picnic skirt. Aha! All right. Key feature of the game. Yeah, there was a there was an uproar um, with the whole ability of not being able to time jump. I remember when the game was announced. 
And not also like not having um what I wanna say. Not having multiple islands on on one uh, cartridge or whatever. Let's dump a bunch of this stuff off. I think we should go see Harvey's island. Maybe I can try to customize these things too that I have out in my yard. Before I go. I know these star fragments are going to come in handy for some purpose, and I just don't know what yet. We're getting in storage. Not today, Satan. I don't like these tissues that I don't know where to put. You wash your hands with those tissues. Ah, look at that! I got into, I got back into FE Heroes. Got three Bernies. Um. I kind of want to get back into three houses. Let's go shirts. This is so cool. <laughs> I love how he's posing. I love it. <laughs> No, I'll leave that that way. I wish I had better shoes. That was cool. Oh wait, did I not save? I didn't save. Did I change my stuff? I don't even remember. <laughs> that was cool. Are you okay with not so spoiler? Um, yes and no. I mean, I'm familiar with the franchise, so there's not much that can spoil me. But if it's like game specific, like if I say like I want to go to... Harvey's Island and you tell me what's on Harvey's Island I'd say that's a spoiler and I wouldn't want that but if it's like um, you're giving me like a tip on like assisting in crafting then I wouldn't consider that a spoiler just something about the fridge oh uh yeah don't say it I have an idea but don't say it <laughs> you made me think about it though let's customize a swinging bench Oh no, let's do the white wood. Cool. Oh, he's slapping paint on it. Okay, so let's do this. I want to paint this. This. Uh, I want to see if I can customize the bench too. Just something funny. Okay, I just did that. Hold on a second. I saw that I can do something with my tools. <laughs> I like the the paint slapping noise. There's a man who's painted my own house a dozen times. Ew, ew, ew. 
I'll do this one, I get. Oh, I have four? Nah. Oh, sick! Oh, that is cool! I know we can customize our tools. Try the train set. Okay, I'm gonna try the chain set. Let me finish with my tools first, though. <laughs> yes! Purple! It gave my bear a shirt. The tools break though. I know, but still. It's cool! Nintendo! Yes! Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. It's the little things. It's the little things. Wow. Okay. Um, hold on. Let's, let's put this stuff back. I like to turn the sound down, like, uh, at night. Yeah, that looks cool. Oh no, my butt got wet with the paint. Okay, the next one's 20. Let's check the train set. I'm gonna check that skull too. Let me think of what else I want to color. I can turn the sound up at night for a beach party. <laughs> so I take the skull. I wanna take this. I wanna take the washcloth. I wanna take the microwave. I wanna take the train set. I take the foosball table. Okay, let's see what we can customize. Oh, I should have took the toilet. It's okay. Customize. Oh, only the sink can be customized. Ew, I don't like that at all. I have a sneaking feeling I can change his DIY table. We'll see. Golden toilet. Okay, let me see. I do have two, uh, two, uh, two golden things. I'm upset I couldn't change my, uh, my skull. Just place it already. I'll mess with the other plain wood stuff later. Oh, the toilet. Let's check the toilet. Thank you so much for the follow, my friend. I appreciate it. And just so you're aware, 
I'm starting to do a lot of the um, midday streams. Um, and then sometimes I stream at about 11 o'clock at night. Eastern Standard. We have uh, upcoming games. We've got Persona 5 Royal. We're going to have Final Fantasy VII Remake. I just got finished with um, uh, completing 100% uh, Kakarot, Dragon Ball Z. Animal Crossing is always going to be a stable, so this is always going to be involved, no matter what. Alright. Oh. I want to test this. It's 12 a.m. here. But Carrot Man. Um, you sound like you're Eastern Standard. Oh, you're, it's 12 a.m. there or p.m. there? Because it's 12 p.m. here, which means you're 12 hours different. Oh, I can. And I will. Gray. Kind of like the blue. Ash brown. Yes. Alright, so... Um, I gotta figure out where I can buy more of these customization kits. Because I'm going to be customizing a lot of things. Yeah, that looks great. Alright. Um, I think we're fine. Let's go to Harvey's Island, guys. I'm really excited about this. Let me see if they end up having the product now available. Yeah, but Kakarot was fun. I actually enjoyed it. After a while, I felt like it wasn't much of a challenge anymore, but... Wildest Dreams DUI. DIY. DUI. No, DIY. I'll drop by what I can. Not sure if we have the most compatible schedules. Yeah, you, you know what? Do what you can. I won't hold anything against it. I understand all you guys have lives and you guys have things to do. Um, so no... I, I won't hold it against you. Uh, beginners, axe, shovel, vaulting pole, ladder, slingshot, watering can. Okay. So let's see what those new things are that we just bought. Don't stop. I don't. Stop making me feel bad, man. But I love you guys. Yo. Oh, now I can make the sink. Wooden fish. <gasps> and a sink. Oh, fart. Okay. Eight clay, two nuggets, six wood. We're making this now. Harvey can wait. We need to make ourselves a brick oven pizza. When did I become such a troll? You never have. You never have, Nom. Where did I go wrong? What have I become? <laughs> Alright, so we're literally gonna just pull out all of our resources. Thirty hardwood, thirty softwood, twenty two regular wood, some iron nugs. Some stones. I think that was all that was needed, right? Yeah. I'm a troll in D and D. Man, when I start to start, when I start preparing myself for the campaign I'm gonna create, starting in like May or whatever, I'm totally gonna be like that. Not so much in regards to the detriment of the players, but. Um, so much for where I want to create like variety and stuff like that. Okay, 
So we need ironwood dresser and a cutting board. And I don't even have the ability to make a cutting board yet that I'm aware of. You know, I need a craft gosh darn bed. That's 18 of 22 wood. So we may have to hold off on that. It is a joke because I am every monster. Oh, I get it. You're saying you're actually a troll. We fought our first troll a couple sessions back and um, we cut its arm off and then the arm became became its own enemy and we're like, is this guy undead? And my DM's like, no. <laughs> okay, so uh, what are the new things I got? I, I have to make a bed for myself. Like I'm still sleeping on a cot for, for goodness sake. But um, if I want to make that, this thing. Oh, I need clay. I didn't grab clay. Caduceus. Where's all my clay? Apparently, my DM said that she has to prepare for one major battle because we're, we're hex crawling um, right now. And um, she said she had to prepare for a major battle. So I'm nervous as to what it is uh, come Sunday. Keep crafting. So it looks like I can't make this yet because I need a cutting board and I need an iron wood dresser. I don't have an iron wood dresser. But iron wall lamp. That's cool. We can paint these. Um, I like how I can check these out and then it'll tell me if I can paint them or not. Only too shy. Can I paint the bonfire? Let's see how big this is gonna be. No room. Yes. Yes. Actually, I don't want to block that area. Yeah, okay. Um. All right, so I wanna I wanna see what we can do to customize this, and then we'll go drop off our stuff, and then go to Harvey's. Red, brown, white, and black. Red is perfectly fine. Oh, look at that! The pizza. Look at that! The beautiful pizza. Oh, make sure it's nice and cooked. Hope my players don't screw up when they go to Asgard. Guess I can dump these off too. My ocarina didn't show like it could get customized, did it? Did I miss that? I think I it can't, but let me double check. No. Oh dang, it can't be painted. How upsetting. I really wanted to paint it blue, like Link's. 
All right, let's go uh, to Harvey's place. I bought all your stuff. You can go home. No, don't. I'm just kidding. Don't pack up. I'm sorry. I was just joking. No, don't do that. Okay. Some people take jokes too seriously. Hello, sir. I like to travel via airplane. <laughs> Uh, I want to fly like an eagle. I visit Harv's Island. Huh? Harv's Island? Where could. Oh! He's talking about the island in his brain, his imagination. The island Harvey lives on. Roger that. Good, buddy. Ah, good. Take off. Dota 1, this is Dota Tower. Oh, I clicked through it. I love the Dodos. I love their inclusion in this game. Touchdown is like playing the kazoo in a camera case. We are parked and proud. Give a quack to Wiggle Wingback. Okay. I'm air drying your clothes, Harvey. Hey there, Turbo. Good to see you again so soon. I mean, I was on the same flight as you over here, so it's good to see you so soon after seeing you. Wait, was that today that we talked, right? Didn't just sleep the whole time since then. Anyway, welcome to Harv's Island. Don't remember if I mentioned it before, but I run a photo studio here. It's called Phototopia. Photopia. Photopia. It's because it's like paradise for picture taking and it's free and all. So come use it anytime. Okay. But I want to see your island. What kind of pizza you got here? Is that a pie? Harv, you have a pie in here? An apple pie? I can understand saying the word pie could confuse people because some people call pizza pies. Let's cook that. Let's see what's in here. All of a sudden, I can't actually see his island. So you dig in the Phototopia vibe? Pretty groovy, right? It's like my own home away from home, you know? I mean, I just walked in, so... <sighs> I haven't seen the whole place. Well, more like my home is my home, really. But hey, since you're here, let's capture the moment on film, huh? If you got any questions about the studio, I am all ears. Well, most of the years, some knows too. Tell me more, bud. Really? That's great. Okay, you've come to the right dog. Yes, sirree. All right, there's basically three things to worry about with pictures. The set, models, and wardrobe. In other words, arrange your space, gather up the folks you want in the picture, and give them costumes. Once you've mastered these three, taking the actual photos is easy, at least in here in Phototopia. You want to hear more about the details, about the sets, models, and wardrobes, or know anything about taking your pictures? I'm good. Okay. I know what it's like living in a studio, surrounded by four floodlights, basically. Okay. When you see an A appeared, hold an Abibo 
Abibo Amiibo. Um. All right, I grab one under my green screen. Let's try this one real quick. What are you talking about? Cyrus can't be invited. Oh. All right, I got Milliger, or Villager and Sable. Let's try. What do you mean you can't read this amiibo? It's the villager from Smash. He's me and I'm you. All right, let's try Sable. I think I need to like go back into it. Okay. So I guess uh, the villager doesn't work. Okay. I am the shadow. What's going on, egg? Alright, I also got Lottie, Kicks, and Rossetti. Let's see if any of these guys work. What we talk about you can't read the amiibo. Said he can't be invited to Phototopia. Well, that's just something. Alright, so the villager can't be invited. Sable works. Cyrus can't be invited. Okay. Let's try Lottie. Lottie can't be invited. Let's try Kix. Okay, so Kix can show up. Maybe they have to be like on a different square? Nope. I'm trying all these now. Let's see who else I got. Isabel and Cap'n. So let's try Isabel. Okay, Isabel shows up. She's in her island outfit, regardless of if she's in her her winter outfit on my amiibo. Let's try Captain. Captain can't show up. All right. Reese can't show up. Let's try Celeste. Celeste can show up. All right, let's put her over here. How about our old friend? Our old dearest friend who conned us into a mayor's job. Rover can't show up. Okay. What about Blathers? Tendon to the museum. Blathers can show up. Okay. What about our good friend uh, Dingy Dog or whatever his name is? Digby can show up. I'm going to try the villager one more time. Can't invite villager to Phototopia, so at least you can read him now. I think I got a couple more. One second. Got a couple more amiibos we can try. So these are the, I'm trying all my Animal Crossing Amiibos. And so far, what you can see on the screen is what works. So let's try KK Slider. 
KK slider works. I'm separating them on my desk here. Tom Nook. Okay, Tom Nook works. Let's see if I can do a different Isabel. Isabel is already on Phototopia, so we can only use Isabel once. Hey, we're testing this out here, guys. Can't read this amiibo. Okay, let's try this one more time. I would like to have both. Can I have both here? Okay. So the Timmy and Tommy amiibo, you can oops, yeah, drop both of them. Um, you have the ability to pick which one of the two you would like to show up. But, last one I'm going to try is Sonic. Let's see, <laughs> Let's see if Sonic shows up here. This amiibo is not supported. Okay, so out of the Animal Crossing ones, the ones you see on the screen are the ones who can show up. Blathers... Oh, that's cool. You can turn them. Isabel. KK Slider. Tom Nook. Timmy and Tommy. And Kix is back there. Because, like, whatever, dude. So those are the only ones that work. So far, the ones that are not working... Which they say, hold on. So they're saying they cannot be invited. So we have Digby, we have Rossetti, we have Cyrus and his wife. I forget her name at the moment. Reese. Cyrus and Reese. They can't be invited. Lottie, Cap'n, the Villager, and Rover. So there's eight of them that I have that cannot be invited, which to me, it sounds like those are pending like story, something involved with a story. But look, we try this out. Oh, do you have something to say? Do you have some, do you have it? You gotta say, oh my gosh, this is terrifying. So they're all like mindless clones that can't speak to you. Oh my gosh, they're all right here. Oh gosh. Timmy and Tommy are hiding by the screen like maniacs. Alright, so... This is creepy that they're all just kind of like... <laughs> we are here waiting for you. Look at them. Maniacs. I'm pretty sure that's all my Animal Crossing amiibos, but it's hard to get behind my green screen right now, so. You can use the characters in your island. So you're saying I could use the amiibo to call these people to my island? Or just in the studio? Egg insect, nope. I ain't got milk. You don't need the amiibo. Explain, my friend. Okay. So now we see what all the rooms look like. There's a menu somewhere. Let's test it out since I have all my uh, amiibos out. You want to bust Bunsen burners and bounce back to Peach Town? I mean, it's called Melee Island, but I mean, I guess it's considered Peach Town. Peaches are. You can select furniture. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Phone is ringing. Hello? Oh, hey, it's Harvey. Calling on the phone part of your phone. 
You left a bunch of clones in my place. What am I supposed to do with them? I forgot to tell you something when you're in Phototopia. Go figure, right? I <laughs> wanted to tell you was about the about any models you invited to the studio. After you introduced us, I thought I'd take a nice portrait and turn it into a poster. Hope you like it. <clears throat> you can use an amiibo for a model that couldn't make it. You use an, amable, an amiibo for a model that couldn't make it, but we'll just go ahead and make a poster anyhow. Set it up with Nook Shopping so you can order them through them. Uh, so order some, please. Let's go check that out. Maybe it's like the ability to, uh, to like get like single portraits of amiibos. Don't you smile at me, Tom Nook. You can now order posters of models you've collected in Phototopia via the special goods in, in Nook Shopping. Yes! So, not, um... So, not Sonic, but it's everyone else. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Thank you so much for the follow, Meerkat John. So I just figured out that you can go to, um, figured out that we can go to Harv's Island. And next time we go out and hang out, John, I have to bring all my amiibos. Because what happens is after you scan them into Harv's Island, then you have the ability to buy all their posters. Timmy, Tommy, Villager. Let's see count. I'm going to count again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 15, 16, 17. If I count Timmy and Tommy separately. Yeah, so I got the appropriate amount. If you select, if you selected the characters that live on your island, you get their posters too. Oh, guys, I have a few of these right now. Got a couple of amiibo, amiibo cards. Stitch, I got Tortimer. Hold on, guys, be quiet. Okay. We're gonna we're gonna try this out. Yo, babe. Sorry, my dogs are barking. My uh, father-in-law just came. Um. So yeah, I have a bunch of amiibos. All right, so we're going to go to Harv's Island, and then we're going to scan. These are just the free cards that I have. Free meaning um, that are not in. I have this. And they, these are all my duplicate cards that are for people who subscribe. For a certain amount of months, um, I'll, I'll mail those cards to you. I've done it in the past, but uh, I have a couple cards that aren't in the sleeves, and I'm gonna see if these work for scanning um, villagers in. And then let's see if we get their posters, because if that's the case, that's really cool. Um, I'm gonna do Tortimer first. Okay. Uh. 
So we're going to go to the design menu. Oh, he can't be invited because he's dead. Stitches. Okay, so this one worked. This is a Stitches card from the Welcome Amiibo pack. So Stitches works. I'm just going to run through all of these. Oh, cool, guys. Here we go, Rosie and Goldie. Rosie and Goldie come with the Welcome Amiibo. I know not a lot of people bought that game. But that's really awesome. I didn't even... That's cool. Okay. Oh, I forgot I had a separate Isabel sitting over here. That's good to know. I think all that means is that you can... That all of them can live on your island, too. Oh, you mean, like, in between... Uh, like, if it says, like, oh, this person can't be invited. Let me see if there's any cool duplicates that I have. Okay, let's try this. So, I have Pascal. Let's try to scan Pascal. Pascal can't be invited. So, I think you might be right, JC, or, uh, JR, excuse me. Uh, let's see if there's anyone else cool... And I want to scan real quick while I'm here. That are just on my duplicates. I have a, I have a whole other folder with my cards. Oh, Pete, you've been replaced by the dodos. Poor Pete. No, he can't come. Um, I have the raincoat, Digby. See if that shows up. No. So I think there is a difference between amiibos and the cards. Oh, I got Apollo. Let's bring Apollo up here. Apollo's my boy. The only card I want that I do not have is uh is um Marshall. Let's try Brewster. Completely messed my green screen up, too. There we go. No Brewster. Guys, we need the cafe here. What about Phineas? What about Phineas? No Phineas. I mean, I, I'm gonna, let's try Leilani. One of the Tortimer family members. Yeah, sorry, this is screwing up my green screen. I'm going to try just two or three more. I'm not going to do these main names because obviously these aren't working. I'm not going to try Gracie. Not going to try Red or Pave. Uh, Tex. I already have Rudy on my island. Let's actually put Rudy in here. Because Rudy's on my island. So maybe I'll get a poster for Rudy. Uh, Tex. Oh, I know what I need to do. Here's Mira. Only 10 characters can be invited at once. All right, so I want to do Mira. Let me actually stop there. Now, I know a lot of people are... Excuse me, pardon me, excuse me, excuse me, pardon me, excuse me. Now, I wonder if I leave and come back, will they be erased? I hope I don't have to leave the whole island and come back. Let's see. Hmm. 
Nope. Okay. So let's see if we can remove them. Oh, why to remove? Man, I don't know if... I don't know if that means that they're going to have their posters removed. Let's try it. So, um, we'll, we'll do one thing. So, let's take Apollo. Let's remove Apollo. And then let's scan in Mira. And then we will test it. So, when we leave, we'll check the posters. We'll come back. And if Apollo is included, that means that as long as we scan them in, we can remove them and still get the posters. They're still testing this. I think it's fine as long as you scan them in at least once. That would make the most sense, JR. I'm pretty sure you're right. Because if that's the case, I'm gonna scan. I'm literally like, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I'll do a stream where I'm just scanning in cards. <laughs> okay. Let's see. I have Walt and Olaf. Lucy, just on this one page of my duplicates. I have a much bigger binder with my cards. I don't have a complete collection, for the record. But there was one Christmas where my wife bought me, like, 40 packs of, like, series one through four. She filled up an entire, like, Christmas bag, like, full of cards. Uh, special goods. Okay, so Apollo showed up, so you're right. So every with everything. Oh, we got Brewster. Oh, guys. Oh, guys. Oh, we got a wall. We also got um. Mira, too. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Well, I know what I'm going to be doing for a while now. I didn't even check to see if there's a Tortimer one. It's okay. Um, this is exciting. The problem I'm now going to have is that we're not going to have enough space to display all these posters. Let's go to Harb's Island. Cool. That's really cool, guys. And, uh, Meerkat John, if, if this is something that you and uh, Sage are interested in, then you let me know, and I'll have to... I'll have to bring my cards and amiibos over one day or something like that once this whole virus thing calms down and we can actually hang out. <laughs> I'm just going to scan a few more. And then we'll go on with the stream. So we got Zucker. Who looks like a Takoyaki. This isn't my favorite cat, but uh, I'll do it anyway. And if you guys don't have these cards and you want posters, and I start doing the uh, the the uh, streams where I visit your islands, just let me know if you want one of these posters. I'll buy one and I'll bring one over for you guys. Uh, let's see. We got one of my favorites. Extremely clever. So clever. They're meta about it. Yeah, that's, that's my boy, Kevin Bacon. Um... I know this is Codemar's favorite. It's a shame she's not in chat right now. She's probably busy. There's Sydney. That's her favorite. So I know she's going to love to get that poster if she doesn't already have it. Uh, Margie, if any of you guys have seen the Animal Crossing anime movie, you'll realize that Margie's adorable. We also have O'Hare. Yes. He is a rabbit who also happens to be Irish. We 
We'll get a couple more in here to just fill this out to 10. We got Hippo. Hippo do? How do you pronounce it? I don't even know. Uh, let's get Walt in here. That puts us at 4, 8. So we'll do two more. We'll do Olaf and Lucy. Meerkat, you may like Olaf. Then Lucy. Very cute, adorable pig. Which apparently I've got like 16,000 duplicates of her. Okay. Awesome. Look at this guy. Look how cool he is. And Walt is like this samurai dude. He's got like a scar on it under his eye. Zucker is clearly a takoyaki, which if you guys don't know what that is, it is considered a squid ball. So they get a piece of a squid tentacle and they cover it in batter. It's in a ball. They slap some soy sauce, um, like a soy sauce, kind of like a barbecue soy sauce, ketchup kind of sauce on top. And they spr sprinkle fish flakes on it as well. And that's the green dots on his face. And that's uh, Zucker. I'm going to go shower, start my own stream, see a turbo. I will uh, join you, my friend. Thank you so much for watching. It's an octopus, actually. He is an octopus. Did I say squid? I meant to say octopus if that's the case. Kevin Bacon is literally a pig. And his name is Kevin. So you can't get any sillier than that. You got O'Hare. Like I said earlier, he's a he's a rabbit. Who also is Irish. Clearly. Okay. Cool. Yeah, I'll, I'll bring like my big pack over. We'll just take them all out page by page and we'll just pass them around and scan them in. I'm going to go, uh, I'm going to look through the, um, posters one more time as well. Now that I scanned everyone in, I'm going to buy, like, two or three. I'm going to try to buy two or three is what I'm saying. <laughs> try to keep it limited. Brewster, I'm definitely getting. Maybe I'll get Tortimer. It may be like Isabel. We'll see. This is so cool. She's singing again. Aww. No, I'm not buying your poster, Tom Nook. I ain't got space for that. Okay. <laughs> I love Bill. Yeah. Places in order. Oh, I can send these as gifts. Oh, oh, I haven't I haven't played with Code Mars yet. Goldie. <laughs> that one looks cool. Aw, Pascal's image is cute. Look at all these guys. <laughs> Hold on. I'm going to send this to uh, Sage. A uh, ah, oh, meerkat, uh, meerkat dropped. Figured, oh, figured out yesterday so you could send things to friends from Book Nook ATM thing directly for Miles though. He jumped out of chat. I was gonna ask him if he wanted one of these posters. Um, Tortimer. Oh, so let's get Tortimer. We already got Brewster. I think I'm going to get a Rossetti for myself. Oh, I'm limited. Okay. 
Okay. That's fine. I get it. Totally get it. I would be buying 20 things a day if that wasn't the case. Totally understand. That's been a consistent rule across the board, so I'm not upset. I think we're gonna go ahead and end it here, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. We may, we may stream this evening. I don't entirely know. It depends on where my energy level is at. But what you can do is you can expect me at least at 11 o'clock in the morning, a.m. or p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.